Hi everybody, this is Titi reading and this reading is going to be for Aquarius, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Let's see what are the messages that pop out for you Aquarius. Let's see Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. What messages do we have for Aquarius? Check out the link in the description box, Aquarius. It's going to take you to the extended. And in the extended, we will clarify more for your person. How are they thinking and feeling about you? Their next moves towards you. Outcome of the situation between the two of you. Advice. Oracle messages. Love notes. And further guidance for you. Like coming up energies that you need to be aware of. So do check it out. It is going to be linked below. What do we have for Aquarius? Let's see. The nine of ones with the tower. Love, okay, but again, something that you are very much guarding yourself from, okay? I see you being in that energy where you're looking back at a situation with like a lot of doubt and it's almost looking like you, you're kind of like, there is communication though, there is forward movement that I see in this, but I think in the past you um, you kind of like expressed yourself and maybe didn't go well. Somebody did not, you know, reciprocate that or whatever the case might be. I do think you're right now, you're very much isolating yourself from a certain situation. A, you look back at it and you think it is a disaster waiting to happen and B, you're kind of like in that energy where if it happens good if it doesn't then you know I'll, I'll find a way out of something so again you're, you're trying to protect yourself from something not because you do not have love but because you just want to protect yourself you know point blank period with the eight of one's energy i do see forward movement in this though okay whatever it is I see willingness on your part to be in a relationship to seek I think you're seeking stability in a certain situation and for a lot of you why am I getting that kind of an energy Aquarius that you've had like a wake-up call here wake up you know I gotta work on my stability wake up I gotta you know start doing this because I want to achieve something so there's that sudden burst of motivation um, that you know has you thinking and it's more so looking like it's making you think from a very like from a point of view where you're trying to seek stability whether it be in your job in a love situation whatever it is okay now that might have not been the way you've been thinking before but it is now okay and again i see you being in that energy where you you've taken a step back to contemplate and there's that huge energy of you having some sort of a wake-up call here you know what am i doing where am i headed towards i want stability i want a house one day i want this 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 that one day i want to be there one day kind of an energy okay let's see there's so much aries leo sagittarius energy here we also have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, and Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Look at that. This is you like thinking and thinking and thinking and being like, I want to do what suits me best. I want to go towards things that make me happy. Uh, because I'm coming from a place of feeling stuck anyway, so I don't want to stay in that position anymore, which is really good, okay? So again, at the end of the day, there's some sort of like happiness that you are working towards, right? You're working towards your happiness, you're working towards your fulfillment here, okay? Um, 
in the middle of that there is somebody wanting to communicate there's somebody coming in with love towards you okay this could be new or a past person um but again you know you kind of are looking at this page of cups situation i think with like a lot of doubt which i said again with the nine of ones energy i see you being not that open to this for whatever reason i actually see you looking at it with you know i'm gonna tell you it's it's almost like you know you've made up your mind that you want to be in a relationship you want to be in a stable situation right and then when this love comes in it is seeming new when this comes in you're gonna be like wait a second is this headed towards what i really want does this have the potential of being what i want so you're you're kind of like thinking and waiting and hoping and you know wanting to have you know forward movement and growth in a situation because you've made up your mind to go there one day there's that sudden burst of motivation as well that i see here with the ace of wands energy there could be something new that you're doing with your life aquarius like something that you've always wanted to do but now is the time you're feeling like motivated all of a sudden to do it because your vision is it's like looking at things with a very clear vision it's like knowing exactly what you want okay and you're ready to take that leap of faith you're ready to change stuff you know you might have been you know in a situation where you weren't doing things and it was you know mentally draining you keeping you stuck but now i see you being in that energy where you know you're ready to take that leap of faith there's some sort of a new beginning happening here which is bringing you towards your stability your goals i do see you achieving goals and being you know in a very stable position again there's some sort of a new opportunity that is coming your way I see stuff changing. For some of you, you could also be planning to travel. I don't know, maybe just thinking about it, wanting to be in a certain place. Again, there's some like, some sort of a goal that you have here. And the reason why you separated yourself from a certain situation was because you thought that it wasn't working out for you. With the Nine of Cups energy, this is your energy. This is where you're headed towards happiness self-fulfillment there is some fulfillment of wishes that i see in this reading as well i actually see you manifesting things but you're very determined you're very determined to close a chapter in your life why because you feel like it why because it just sits right with you it sits well with you to do this you know you're, you're following your intuition you're it's it's like i don't know how to say this but you have recognized yourself why because you've done the inner work you're leaving not because you do not love but because you feel like it's a necessity right now to go off to your happiness then pursue a situation where it's not really leading to what you want right so in the back of your in the back of your head in the back of your mind i see you visualizing and wanting to have certain things in life and taking path toward that if if that makes any sense okay so again this is a lot of self-growth this is a lot of self-love that i see in this reading honestly somebody has matured okay you of course um it's like i am determined to go after what i want my happiness matters i've been so over giving and I've, I've neglected myself so much that now is the time that I'm going to put that energy back into myself. Okay? And there's love coming in. There's prosperity. There's abundance. All right? The signs that I hear are Pisces, Capricorn, Cancer, like I said before. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, Gemini too. Okay? check out the link in the description box it's going to take you to the extended and in the extended we will clarify more for your person how are they thinking feeling about you what is the outcome of the situation between the two of you advice oracle messages love notes um yeah and what is the advice from the universe for you what are the coming up energies for you so do check it out it is going to be linked below 
we have look at the bigger picture. Isn't it what I've been talking about all throughout this reading? You looking at the bigger picture, you actually realizing things. We have end of a tough cycle approaches, full moon in Capricorn. If there was a dark period in your life, you don't you don't have to worry because I see things changing for you. I, I see a major shift in the energy. Surrender to the divine and see what happens, you know. Whenever this card comes to me, this talks about once you surrender, once you let go, you will see how things unfold for you. And this is again your confirmation that the tough cycle that you've been a part of is is it's coming to an end, okay? Believe in the impossible. Look at these cards. A new start is coming and then believe in the impossible so this is you manifesting things that you've been thinking about but maybe you were not that sure of so don't sell yourself short on your dreams your goals your passions I see good energies coming up your way but before that you might be forced in into a situation where you have to change your perspective I don't think I need to say these things because this is something you're already doing. Okay. Let's see what the romance angel oracles have to say for you. This could be the one you've met, the romantic partner you seek. There's somebody who thinks that you're the one for them. Unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going with the new love. So there might be a situation where you felt like your love wasn't being well reciprocated. Okay, so you just gave up on it. But then, you know, there's that new love. There's a new cycle. There's something new beginning here. Again, like I said before, there's a change and shift in the energy for you. We have make the effort. <clears throat> Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. Retreat, playfulness, forgiving and learning. Again, with these energies, Aquarius, um, there's somebody making an effort towards you. Loving yourself first. See, so I do feel like you're putting yourself first. You're definitely, you have separated yourself from a situation because for for whatever reason you 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 felt like it wasn't well reciprocated okay let's get you one more the night of one this is you this is you leaving something behind and working towards your goals at the end of the day there's happiness there's some sort of a wish fulfillment that i see for you but it also maybe is you know coming from you leaving something and i actually see something you know changing in your life for the for the better okay there's arrival of somebody as well here that i see so that's about it those were the energies that popped out for aquarius give this video a like and subscribe to my channel check out the link in the description box and it's going to take you to the extended and in the extended we will clarify more for your person how are they thinking and feeling about you their next moves towards you outcome of the situation advice oracle messages and love notes okay so do check it out if you want some further guidance that's it take care and bye, -bye.